the summer bushfires of, of last year, of 2019-2020, burnt through 93% of the Kangaroo Island Dunnart's known range. We identified one last remaining patch of bush at what we're now calling the critical refuge area. And within that last patch of bush, we detected a very small population of Dunnarts. Very quickly, Australian Wildlife Conservancy, working with the Kangaroo Island Land for Wildlife and the landholders, the Dobe family, mobilised and worked together to construct a fence to secure that population and keep the pressure of feral cats off that little small population of Kangaroo Island Dunnarts. Following that project, we then mobilised and decided that the next stage was to increase it to 370 hectares worth of protected area. We know that the single biggest threat to many native species is a feral cat. And the feral cat is a scourge of Australia's native species. And the only way to really mitigate the impact of the feral cats is to construct and manage large-scale feral predator-free fenced areas. The Western River Refuge on Kangaroo Island, a partnership between the Dobb family, Kangaroo Island Land for Wildlife, and supported so importantly by the Australian Wildlife Conservancy, a major environmental NGO that is doing work all across Australia. We now have a sanctuary in place here, uh, which can be used to study, to better understand our wildlife, and importantly, to create a protected space, uh, which will give not only the Kangaroo Island Dunark, but lots of other species a fighting chance into the future detecting kangaroo and dunnarts within here that have pouch young so we know that the species is reproducing currently which is probably the best measure of success that we could be hoping for and we also have a whole host of other threatened species that are benefiting from the fence and feral cat eradication including the kangaroo and echidna the heath goanna uh, the southern brown bandicoot another endangered species the bayesian thrush western whitbird and also the southern emu wren the only population uh, of all of those species that is currently uh, free to, to live their life without the constant threat of feral cat predation. This is providing a really important refuge for these key species now and for the future.